Now that we changed the look of our terminal, let's have a look at our program. So we're gonna install first this one, install only the software at once. So that makes our life a little bit easier and we can explain a lot of stuff. Open in terminal, we've changed the look of it in the previous movie and we're gonna install all and then you press always tap and then enter. It's going to install a lot of things. You just open it here and let's quickly change the look because it's much too dark. References, fonts, oblivion, fine, go there. Get rid of this. There you go. So is adding Spotify. Spotify will be installed. This is just a copy paste from Spotify.com. How to install Spotify on Linux. This is Google Chrome. Google Chrome is up here. Forgot to stop this here so I can go back and show what is going on here. So the following new packages will be installed. Spotify is installed here. Google Chrome is stable, is installed here. Preparing to unpack. Sublime text is going to be downloaded. And then we are in this line here. Sublime text. Here we are at Variety. So Variety is here. Variety is a program which gives us beautiful wallpapers and changes them and so on. Great tool. Um, We are at the lines, so all these lines will be executed. Maybe good thing to read a bit. So you are an administrator, sudo apt-get install me Adobe Flash plugin, the catfish, the clementine. So catfish is looking for something, clementine is music and so on and so on. I can't go over all these little things. But these are all programs I install, I ask the system to install automatically so I don't have to go and find it uh, separately because there is a possibility software manager install new applications there is a program i'm not sure if it will work together with my script but i think it will and there if you don't know anything about linux you don't know what software is good and what's not then you can go and look and see what people think so all the points they get and minecraft is here as well haha <laughs> so a lot of stuff the steam gaming and all that so now you know a little bit more already so you can go inside i'm interested in programs from the internet so you go check that out so i have done my work uh, in that regard and i say i want this i want that i want that and install me everything now so that's what he's doing he's checking and checking and downloading and installing preparing setting up is uh, setting up Nemo Dropbox, gotta fix that because this is not Nemo, this is copy paste from elements of um, Cinnamon. So I'm wondering if it will ever work on Cinnamon, but it might work. So it does seem to work. Then we can leave it in. Yep, I think it will work. So that's not an issue then. Now we leave it in. It's called Nemo Dropbox, and Nemo is a file manager for um, Cinnamon, so not Thunar. But okay, whatever works, works for me. And then the rest of installations programs are going to be downloaded I see no errors I see nothing strange everything is unpacked here we are already at VLC is the latest yeah I had to download VLC because of uh, the movies I'm making Samba so we are no recommended no we're somewhere else we are at the Terminator line here. So this is the Terminator, Tunar, VLC, VNSAT, Windbind is 
if it's already installed it won't do anything otherwise it will install the programs so that's that unzip is going to be installed meaning we are here should get rid of this here nemo care compare i don't think we'll ever gonna use this because nemo again is something for linux mint so what we do if you see something wrong or say oh, i don't want that program this is easy you just put a hashtag in front of it the whole line will not um, be installed as simple as that so things like that can be easily fixed and now we have a better script and i'll post it online and you'll have a better script so we are at the end and the end was the breeze cursor theme and a lot of information uh, a lot of programs has has been installed and let's check it out okay so this is version 3 as you saw but uh, let's make this version 4 then we change something and we just push it to you guys now it's on github and you will have version 4 to download without the nemo compare and that's how, how easy github works a lot of programs have been installed uh, let's go for uh, just look let's look scroll down and then explain one by one clementine is new um, dropbox is new focus writer is new not sure if GIMP was new, but it's already installed. GPIC is new. GR Sync to synchronize between a hard disk and a desktop. Um, external hard disk. Kazam is new. Compare things. OpenShot is also new. Pinta is new. Blank is new. And Spotify is new this is new terminator is new and there we are so a lot of things has have been installed and now it's up to us to to use it and learn how to uh, fine tune it maybe 